like action or something. Action. Okay. This Speak from, loudly. This sunflower was grown by me at my own school, Lemon Wire. And I grew it from one small seed about this big or so. And it grew into this sunflower. And, um... Grandpa and my grandma and me, we all grew, grew this big garden together. The onions were grown by us as well. And the peppers were also grown. And I'm pretty sure it was, I didn't see, but I'm pretty sure that my grandma helped with these zucchinis. And these. These are some flowers. We d we really didn't plant them, but they really just grow on their own, pretty much. Actually, we did plant those. Oh, we did? Yeah. They came from Bowler. Apparently, we did plant them. <laughs> Grandma Daskasel. They've Daskacel. been in the Dubler family for, for, for years and years and years and years, and I brought back quite a long time ago. I brought some back. Yep. And over this way. Corn should be ready soon. Over right here, all these leaves and stuff were grown by at least four small gi pump Atlantic giant pumpkin seeds. And it, before the, the Atlantic giant started growing, like, the year before this year, like, um, we grew, um, little gourds that are shaped like eggs, and if you come over here, you'll see one of the Atlantic Giants growing. Right in here, right, right here is the Atlantic Giant that was growing. And that is pretty much our garden. <laughs> Good job, Willie. And that pumpkin's going to get way bigger than that, huh? Oh, yeah. It's going to get giant. Mm hmm Like an Atlantic giant. And the corn is... What? Big. Yeah. It's going to be ready to pick soon, huh? Yep. Like maybe uh, two weeks? Yep. All yeah. right. Let's head in and show Grandma's video. And do we like eating our food from the garden? Yeah. We love eating this food <laughs> from our garden that we grow from small seeds. Atlantic Giants, the corn, the tomatoes, and everything else in this garden. And that is this video. Okay. The end. <laughs> That's the garden. Can you take me over and show me this big giant tree? We planted that too. Oh, yeah. oh I did. Oh. This ginormous tree was grown by my grandpa, Jeff. And he grew it from one, just one, very small branch. About this tall, this wide, pretty much. Little, little branch, just like these little branches here. Just like these little, little branches here. Yeah. These are some beetles. Don't touch Wash. them because they're more attracted to water. Huh. And there. then... This tree is probably 17 years old, maybe 18. This tree is probably 17 or 18, 18 years old. This bridge that goes from this side to this side, it was built by my family, mostly Grandpa though, because he's more of the construction man of the house. <laughs> um... Also, this, this is the tree up close, right here, this is the tree up close. The big tree, huh? Yeah, really, really big tree. 
And this is a swing set that my grandpa put up here for whenever I came in here, I could swing it. And now kinda I'm going to show you some of the milkweed pots. It's kind of like a fort in here, isn't it? Yeah. Come on, let's go see the milkweed pots. Well, actually, that's not. Why? It's way down the other end, and we'll, we'll call it a, the end. Sure. How's that sound? Okay. okay. We're actually not going to visit the um, milkweed pods because they're quite a ways down there, and this is the end of the video. <laughs> Good job, Willie. Yeah. Wait. Okay. What was that? What? That handshake. Oh, that was the Cub Scout handshake. Thank you. Good job. Still rolling?